Hello friend, in this tutorial, we are going to learn how to configure SSH on Ubuntu. But before that, you must know, I am Satish Tiwari from Ethical Hacking Tuition Center Jaipur and you are watching my YouTube channel slash root in. Let's learn how to configure SSH, a remote login program on your system. So this is my Ubuntu Linux machine. Just right click anywhere and open the terminal. Maximize the terminal. If you want to zoom, you can zoom from here. You can see this option. You can zoom from here. First task is to check the IP address. So I'm going to check the IP address. Okay. It's asking the password for user Satish. And here it is. This is my IP address 192.168.29.11. After doing this, you have no the IP address. Clear this screen. I am going to install the SSH package. How to install? sudo apt install open SSH server. This is the name of the SSH package which is required for installing SSH. Just press enter, press Y for yes, and this will uh, install SSS server package inside your Ubuntu 22 machine. Okay, now after installing this package, what we need to do? We need to allow the firewall. Okay, we need to tell the firewall that hey, allow me uh, to run. Okay, so firewall will allow SSH service. So how you can do that? Just type sudo ufw allow and either you can type the port number which is 22 or you can type the name of the service simply. That's done. Okay, after this optional but you need to know sudo system ctl. Okay, check the status SS and you can see SSH is active and running. Okay. Similarly, if you type, if you want to enable it, you just type sudo and then you can type ufw enable ssh, you know, uh, by default, uh, already we have enabled ssh service here, so we don't need to do this, okay, just clear the screen and done. Now you can go to your windows machine and you need to download a software, name of the software is putty. P U W T Y put you okay. This is a third party software, free software, uh, client for SSH. Okay, so you can see you can download this from this website. I have already downloaded and installed it. Now, how to open it? Just type P U T Y put it and open this terminal. Here is asking the IP address. Type the IP address of Ubuntu machine that is 29.11 and the port number 22. Okay, then click on open accept asking for login as login name so login name satish a password password is red hat in our case just type it and here it is you are logging with the satish user using ssh if you want to check okay you can see you are login here okay you can run any command you want to see all the linux commands are available here okay if you just want to clear the screen clear this screen and if you want to confirm who is login you can check here from who command who am i or just type who command it is telling that 192.168.29.208 this is the ip address of the client machine that is my windows machine who is remotely logging to this system through this user so this user okay so you can also find out who is logging to your system and through which ip so this is that uh, this is all about ssh server it's very simple you can simply install ssh and one can remotely log into your machine using SSH. Okay, uh, the optional server is Telnet. I have already uploaded a video on Telnet, so you can just watch that video. If you want to learn how to configure and install Telnet server on Ubuntu machine, you can watch that. Next video, I will bring you with some another service like file service, okay, like Samba server, how to configure Samba servers to transfer data between Windows and Linux. Okay, so we can easily transfer data between Windows and Linux using the Samba server. Very soon, that video will be uploaded. Keep watching and keep supporting. Thank you. Thank you for watching.